So thank you for tuning in again to Averse a Day. God bless you. Let's just head right on into prayers. Father, we thank you again for today. We give you all the glory. We thank you for the privilege of life. We thank you for the opportunity to look into your word. We ask that you speak to us, that you will teach us your ways because your ways are highways. Thank you for answering our prayers in Jesus' name. Amen. Our verse for today is a continuation. We are studying from Psalms 121 and we are on verses number three it says he will not let my your food to be moved he will keeps you will not slumber hallelujah praise God and if he says he will not let your food sleep he will watches over you will not slumber the message say he won't let you stumble your guardian God won't fall asleep God will not let you when you run to God for help he will not let you see shame. He says he will not let your food to be moved. You will be, you will be fixed no matter what. He will be ready to help you. Because he that watches over you, he doesn't slumber. God doesn't blink his eye. He is not sleeping. He is watching you 247. And he knows when to step in, how to step in. He is in charge. I look to the hills. My help is not from the hills. My help is from God that made the heaven and the earth. And he that made the heaven and the earth, he will not let my foot to sleep. He set his angels charge over me lest I touch my foot against a stone. He that watches over me doesn't sleep. No matter what fights, what battles, what attacks, he doesn't sleep. He will not let my foot be moved. He doesn't slumber. Slump. He doesn't go into a state where he's unaware of things going on. He is constantly aware of all the 7 billion people plus billion people on earth. And yet he takes his time on me. He takes his time on you. Why would you like this kind of person to be your help? So we are privileged to have God as our help because he will not let our food sleep. He will not let us get to that point where people will laugh at our God. No. He that watches over us doesn't slumber. What a privilege to be loved by this God and to be cared after by him. So God is telling you and I, because you've come to me for help, rest in my love. Be secure in this because I will not let your foot sleep. I will uphold you. I will keep you. I do not slumber. So that's a verse for today. That's a, that's a word verse for today. That's an encouragement at the same time. God is telling you and I, we are secured in him. So go ahead, like, share, and subscribe. Let someone get to know that because they have run to God for help. God is able to keep them. God is able to support and sustain them. All right? So as I always say, read this for yourself and let God minister to you. I'm Inspired Grisel and thank you for tuning into Aversa Day today. God bless you.